here's a quick video on how to install our barn wood. Be sure to take the staples out if you find any. And there's the product. It's real wood, real cedar. Once you unbox it, look it over and decide how you want to lay it out. We're going to install a little bit of wainscoting here today and we're going to run into the corner and just out of that corner right there. A real simple thing, so let's get started. So the first cut we're making is 36. That's going to be the height of our wainscoting. And then we're going to come back and put that 10 degree angle at the top. Make sure you square cut the end. Sometimes the factory end isn't true. We're gonna butt a couple of these scraps together and utilize them. It's got a real reclaimed salvage look. It's worth doing, it's worth saving the material. So we're gonna take one of our boards and we're gonna rip it at a 10 degree angle to match the angle that we put on the top of the vertical boards. You see that angle? That should match perfectly. So for this particular product, we are going to use a adhesive to apply it to sheetrock. So the sheetrock isn't the best substrate to be applying to, but it's plenty adequate for, for Wayne's cotting and certainly the barnwood. We're going to use an 18 gauge finish nail just to basically hold it on the wall while the glue dries. So here's one of our scraps that we're utilizing. I shouldn't call them scraps, they're end cuts. but we can still use that. I'm gapping a little off the floor because we'll put in a quick baseboard at the end. And we're just watching this line right here and making sure that we continue maintaining that, that line. Put a little bit of adhesive on the top. And then the baseboard, just rip down to three and a half inches in this particular case and cut the length. Real simple. Straightforward. I'm not going to glue this because we're nailing into wood now. The nails will be strong. It should be adequate. Touch up. I've got a trick for that. On some of these ends, a little bit of graphite does the trick. Works really well. So there you have it. A very easy installation. A simple product to use. Fun to use. Don't be afraid of it. Dive right in.